Aquarius, hi, this is Jackie Tom. This is your general reading for the week of February 6, 2023. Thank you guys for stopping by. So a couple of the energies that may or may not resonate with you this week are going to be a Libra, an Aries, and a Pisces. I have to warn about your temper, okay? Um, there's something coming in. You get what you want, but I don't think it's in the form that you're expecting. You need to stop beating yourself up and get ready for a very fast pace okay it is a week about getting things under control but like i said there's something there with your temper and it's like the calm before the storm because it's asking you to get the rest that you need okay when you need it so let's move forward for the aquas this is your week of february 6 2023 first card up temperance now we are filming live so if you're on the youtube format if you scroll below the video you will see that uh the chat room is available temperance comes in with a sagittarius energy it says you recognize and embrace when you do um when you do the same thing over and over again you get the same results you've recognized and embraced this and because of this this tells me that you're going to do things differently, okay? You're going to do things differently with a much more positive result. We have the three of wands, okay? Three of wands, you're losing patience. You're waiting for your ship to come in. It's kind of like you're standing there tapping your foot, going, Jackie, I'm doing everything right. What is going on? You have the moon. That's the problem. Divine timing, meaning the timing of when things take place is out of your hands. Divine timing, when I speak to you about this, this is when things have to line up and fall into place in order for the next event to occur. The fact the moon is here could be coming into that time frame. You guys have the chariot. The chariot is the yes answer. It's you getting everything you want and desire. It comes unexpected and it comes in the nick of time what I'm seeing here. Unexpected in the nick of time and when you least expect it. Okay. And we have in the center of the reading, the eight of wands follows that total happiness, total contentment, love arrows flying around with the five of cups. No overthinking things. Aquarius, you are famous for this. Okay. When you overthink, you take your energy from up here to down here. No overthinking, you know, ever analyzing, just find a natural flow for this week. And we have the Page of Pentacles, Capricorn Energy, good business deal coming into play. We have the Seven of Swords, someone shady here, someone shady in the circle. Um, someone is either, I mean, this usually indicates lies and deceptions. Um, I don't so much to see as lies and deceptions as I do that someone's not telling you everything. And we have the Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords comes off with a Virgo energy. This could be unexpected um, advice. And honestly, it's really good advice. So let's see what we have to go with this for the Aquas. Okay, with this on the Temperance, we have the Queen of Pentacles and Aquarius energy. Aquarius and Aquarius, you are totally stubborn, set in your ways, not wanting to change. Keep an open mind. We have the Two of Pentacles. If you're juggling financially, this is news of new money coming in. And we have the Knight of Pentacles. Definitely something rushing in with this good business deal. Okay. On that chariot. Remember that chariot trumps your reading. And we have the Ace of Cups. So you love rushing in. You love unexpected. Eight of Wands. Fire Department. That sounds like passion in the love life. What y'all think? All right. We have the Eight of Swords. And that Eight of Swords card of self-imposed restrictions. That's on top of the Eight of Wands. Two eights together indicates total and complete abundance. And then we have the Five of Cups. Five of Cups comes in with the Three of Pentacles. You're working on growing your money. You're working on a side hustle. Some of you are looking at starting a business. And for whatever reason, I just saw a restaurant. Restaurant, cafe, it's going to resonate with somebody. 
and on the page of pentacles we have the ten of swords healing healing from someone in the past and we have on the seven of swords the star card wish fulfillment delays in your favor delays yes anyway divine timing yes delays yes okay so you know and the queen of swords comes in with the three of cups celebration get together three or more people dinner out hanging out but unplanned okay now your center of the reading bonus for my aquarius comes in you have the high priestess you're grounded you're centered you know, you've got to, you're intuitive, okay? Tap into that gut feeling. You're having such a hard time with trusting with where you're being led. So tap into that, you know, trust it, follow it, live it. All right, Aquarius, that's what I have for you. Pretty amazing reading. Uh, we are doing love specials over on the members only side if you're interested. Uh, members only, you can find the link in the description box below or visit YouTube's channel's homepage. For the join button. Alrighty, guys, you have a great afternoon. If you're following me, uh, last but not least, I'm logging off, coming right back. Pisces, Pisces, you are up next. The last read for now. Okay.